Hello. Today we're going to teach you how to play soda pop. So first, we must set up six cups at each side. Back row gets three cups. Choose to separate. Next row gets two cups. And then on top, we have one cup, forming a triangle of sorts. You must first fill up all your cups with soda. Who starts and who picks which side of the table they would like to be on? It's decided by a coin toss. In soda palm, you must make sure that your elbow does not pass the airspace of the table when you take a shot. So. In soda palm, we play as teams of two versus another team of two. If me and my partner both sink a ball into my opponent's cups, then we get both the balls back, and vice versa. But if I sink, a, sink my ball into their cup and my opponent doesn't, both the balls go to the opposing team. In soda ball, if you get the ball into a cup, your opponent has to drink it. There are two ways to get the ball into the cup, with a bounce shot and with a normal shot. A bounce shot is where the ball goes off the table and into the cup, a normal shot is when it just goes in the air. If you get a bounce shot, your opponent must drink two of their cups, whereas if you get a normal, a normal shot, they must only drink one. Here's an example of a bounce shot. This is a normal shot. In soda pop, there's something called a rebound shot. A rebound shot is when I take a shot, if I miss, I can always run and get the ball, and then take a trick shot. Here's an example. Now I've retrieved the ball. Now I take a trick shot. In soda pop, your opponent can request that you replace your cups into a formation that's easier to shoot at, like so. At this point in the game, if my opponent sinks both my cups, I have a chance for a redemption shot. A redemption shot is when me and my partner will both throw our balls into my opponent's cups to try and sink whatever I can of their cups, as, as much as I can, so that we won't have that much to drink at the end of the game. Once a team emerges victorious by sinking its opponent's cups, it can then choose its next opponent. The game of soda pong is generally played with beer and not soda. However, since we're under 18 and we abide by the law, we play with juice as we always do together. 